In this video, we are going to look at arthrokinematic assessment and treatment for the caudal capsule of the hip joint. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. The aim of roll glide assessment is to gain information on reactivity of the joint and of course articular problems such as capsular limitations. For this assessment, the patient can comfortably lie on the unaffected side with the hips and knees slightly bent while you stand behind them. The leg is brought into abduction and the other hand is placed over the greater trochanter. Then the cranial roll is applied by abducting the leg and the caudal glide with your other hand on the greater trochanter. Assess for movement quality during roll and glide, possible pain provocation and end feel. For end feel assessment, roll and glide to end range. Then assess if further gliding is possible or not. In a hypo mobile joint, the glide is reduced relative to the roll component, so no further gliding is possible. If you feel that the end feel or movement quality is abnormal, you can directly move further from assessment to intervention, as the movements that are performed are essentially the same. When used as an intervention, make use of the Maitland grades of mobilization to dose your techniques. Check the video in the top right corner to learn more about that concept. Okay, you've reached the end of the video. If you like, you can check out more videos on manual therapy in the playlist on the left. Again, check the info icon in the top right corner for the featured video and also take a look at the links in the video description down below. At last, subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet and hit the bell icon next to the subscribe button. This will let you know once we release new videos. As always, this was Andreas for PhysioTutors. I'll see you in another video. Bye.